We can start with the first question on the list. And this is, if God is there, why is there so much pain and suffering in the world? Um, there's been pain and suffering in the world from day one. When in the Old Testament, uh, Adam and Eve uh, sinned, uh, there were consequences, uh, death, uh, sorrow, work, pain, etc. from day one. Uh, and there's always been sorrow in the world. The world is full of sorrow and problems. Um, in the Old Testament, uh, um, the Jews were slaves in Egypt for a long period of time. Um, uh, when man was very, very sinful, uh, it was God's plan that uh, there was a, a flood. Uh, probably millions of people died then. Uh, so there's always been pain. In the 20th century, two, two, two uh, world wars, uh, and etc. There's always been pain, pain and suffering in the world. This is nothing new. And um, uh, the result, uh, pain and suffering, uh, first of all, our theologians say that n nothing is done without the um, uh, providence of God. God allows this to happen, for, usually for one reason, uh, for reasons of healing. After such great suffering and pain, uh, people um, change their ways and um, from sinful lifestyle to uh, a more God-like Christian lifestyle. So God heals in these, these methods. 